far down the road from Daily Waters. We're uh, first here at this uh, gravel pit, um, just shy of Bitter Springs. So it's nearly midday, so there's no use getting into Bitter Springs with every man and his dog school holidays and things. So we'll park here. Bitter Springs is only 14 k's up the road. So um, we'll nip in there early in the morning, do a couple of floats, and then see what the rest of the day brings. We'll start making our way to Humpty Doo. It's going to be a bit of a ride there, but yeah, we, we could only get dates in Darwin to actually stay for two days, and that was going to be the fourth and the fifth I think it was so if we go to Humpty Doo it's about 30 k's from Darwin from there so we'll do Humpty Doo for two or three days then get closer to Darwin with our two nights that we've got and then we'll whip back out to Humpty Doo <laughs> so um, yeah we'll see what brings it's territory day the first which is tomorrow and then it's cracker night and um, yeah, school holidays and Darwin Festival and all that sort of shite, so spot yeah. So here we are arriving at Bitter Springs. Uh, we are here very early because I hear it's very busy. Brr, gotta make this quick. We got here early. We got here early. Um, Cause, I mean, it's school holidays and it's raining and it's cold. Where would you rather be but in one of these waters? It's beautiful, it's about not 30 degrees, I reckon. Um, just gonna jump back in cause it's warmer in the water than it is. Actually, I might do the same. <laughs> I just didn't want in my camera. Um, so, we're having a great time. We parked at that, I think it's As, Asley, or As, Asley, Asley. Oh, oh. Here we go. Oh. oh, this is lovely. That's the way to do it. So we parked 15 k's down the road at the um, Asley Cemetery, which is where one of the um, authors, I believe, of the book was made into a film, Weird the Never Never. You can look that one up. But yeah, we stayed um, down there last night. Fan fantastic. We were the first ones there about um, 11 o'clock in the uh, morning. And um, yeah, nice and quiet. There was about five others arrived. But there was plenty of room down there for us all. 
we got up early thinking that this would be really busy and we've just done what is it 7.30 now we got here at 6 in the water at 6 yeah in the water at 6 so we've done three um, laps of this pool and um, just magical and really peaceful because it's a little walk back to the van but we have got to be further up the road because of you know well here we are worried about school holidays and congestion there's nothing we're still worried about school holidays and congestion further up but um yeah we're going to make our way to at least pump do which is about 348 k's from here yeah, it should be a nice slow easy trip with this weather the way it is but yeah highly recommend it make sure you guys bring a pool noodle yeah um we've got one we have mount isaac we've got one there and um yeah it's nice and relaxing with a pool noodle it's good so yeah takes about 20 minutes to float down to the bottom stairs um, where you can come around again and do the lap again but there is a set of stairs on the other side you can get out and finish the swim if you want to lots of fun i could talk for ages because we don't want to get out of the water but <laughs> gotta make a move yeah gotta make a move let's go let's go <laughs> here we go yes steam it is definitely colder out than it is in um i think yeah 30 30 odd degrees in the water and it would be about i think it was 14 15 degrees when we arrived this morning but yeah absolutely magical spot an oasis again with the palms the birds in the morning and we're going to go and warm up there you go quick run Karan bitter springs we've just been for a quick dip this morning and uh yeah obviously the car park is in this area here we had a, a quick walk to the swimming area here and uh, you do a float you can get out this way this area here if you want and walk around again or best float all the way down to the bridge get out of the bridge area there and walk back and do it we've been here for um, about an hour and a half and managed about three floats so um yeah wonderful very nice very quiet um, there's only two cars in the car park and ours and it's about um, about quarter to eight yeah, so we're very lucky so one little thing that worried me when I came to Bitter Springs was parking especially for, for a caravan the rig is not a lot um, this is coach so I guess maybe the odd bus would come in here and park up and let people off um, but so there's a uh, one here on the, the right and one here on the left and there was two bays like that one there on that side and then you just drove on through or come on through here and then um, there was some more car parking over in that right hand side if you turned right I think and then you got some in there and some just in the background you can just see a white vehicle flashing around so not a lot of parking and not a lot of big caravan parking I guess one two three four five six maybe seven or eight vans if you park sensibly what are you doing that's a giant termite mound here in Manarinka. A cracker isn't it well we've been swimming bitter springs just over there there's not down with rain but we got wet anyway beautiful warm 30 degrees temperature we floated it three times lovely highly recommended Sorry Mataranka, can't stay, we were just whistling on through, but um, yeah, good spot to stay. <laughs> 